This week would have marked the deadline for census counting, but it has been extended through October 31st. Organizations are now partnering for one last push to make sure every person is counted. WRTV's Troy Washington shows us the event on the far east side put together with progress in mind. We've got $675 million that are determined by the census, and we need everyone to count themselves. The Exchange Club at Indianapolis Urban League and the Community Alliance of the Far East Side teamed up today to make sure every person counts. Event organizers say this is an important event, especially since census counting has been extended through October 31st. They called it a family block party full of family fun, music, and plenty of food. An event like this is needed, especially right now as we're in the middle of the pandemic. Some of the restrictions are lessening, so a time that people can come out, still enjoy the nice weather as we're approaching fall, and just bring awareness to the community and to be engaged with their families as well. And Kisha did mention it's free, guys. I'm going to get my free food yes. and free icy over here. It's a little chilly, but I love ice, ice cones. <laughs> For every person that's not counted, that could be around $30,000 worth of funding that doesn't make it into the community. You know, the sense is all about power. It is about power and money. And so it divides up the lines where our elected officials are, are picked from. It helps us to get money to our communities for access to amenities like food, which is huge, and health resources. Transportation is also decided by that. Money that matters to this community. So it's important for us to understand the census tracts that are underreporting. And the census tracts where we live, where black folks live in Indianapolis, are the areas that are underreported. So as a whole, we're a little bit over 64% and self-reporting. But in our neighborhoods, in our census tracts, we're around 33%. Aside from making sure everyone is counted, the party made sure to place an emphasis on voting because with November elections on the way, they say every voice matters. Working for you on the Far East Side, Troy Washington, WRTV. Troy, thank you. The exchange partnered with CAFE as part of their Leadership Fellowship Service Project. School supplies were also given out at today's event.